The year is 2040 and cash is gone. The world has transitioned to government-issued digital credits. You walk by a street performer, tipping them with a scan of your face. All transactions are linked to your digital ID, which is monitored by the government, aided by surveillance cameras, AI and data analytics. Any wrongdoing in your credits are automatically deducted from your account. Paper and metal money are now illegal. All financial privacy has disappeared. Then there's auto-taxing and programmed inflation. Credits are automatically and unpredictably deducted for tax, and credits become worth less in the future as governments create more out of thin air. The gap between rich and poor has never been wider, as poor citizens struggle to save credits and only the rich have enough credits to store in scarce assets. This is the future of centralized digital currency. But thankfully, we have an alternative. In 2009, a pseudonymous programmer, Satoshi Nakamoto, launched Bitcoin, a sovereign financial system. The decentralized money project grew through global collaboration, creating an unstoppable distributed network that authorities could not control, thereby empowering financial freedom to global citizens.